If I had a dollar for every idiot driver out there, I would have been granting loans to Elon Musk and Jeff Bezos. There is absolutely no end to these guys, and today we're back with more idiots on the road. I hope you're ready to laugh because today we have a crazy collection. Sit back, relax, and grab your snacks as we jump right into the circus. During a chase, a suspect gets smacked and rammed into by the police, who are very desperate to stop the driver before they cause more damage. When the officer rams into the driver, he stupidly steps on the brakes and makes everything worse. Drifting around is not everyone's specialty, especially not this guy's. The idiot hits the pole and causes it to break down right on top of his car. Here is why lane discipline is important. A driver tries making a U-turn from the right side and even had the audacity to not use his blinkers. This driver got cut off by someone who is clearly using neither the mirrors nor their brake. This caused the car to change lanes and the reaction resulted in them losing traction of their car. Looks like someone here forgot to look after the maintenance of their car and drifted their rear wheel clean off. This driver was approaching a red light and slowed down to stop in line when all of a sudden, a maniac came flying out with no regard to cars coming on the road and slammed right into this guy. Unfortunately for this red truck driver, another red truck driver decided to change lanes without using mirrors or even blinkers, causing him to crash right into the idiot. These things clearly need better brakes too. Takeovers are just catalysts that 100% guarantee accidents. These guys really need to understand that it is not cool anymore, and all it does is empty your wallets. To say that these guys didn't see each other while crossing the intersection would be a lot. They were right in each other's visions and still managed to crash. Both of them should turn their licenses in. These guys were zooming around in their car thinking it was a Formula One car. They went full speed into the corner and had a head-on collision with a parked car. Maybe dad won't be giving them a car anytime soon. Here is why close quarter cutting is dangerous in traffic. This driver switched lanes and probably couldn't see the car on the other lane, rear-ending the poor guy. Feast of luck. Luck. Spell. This man decided to impress his girlfriend by speeding down the road, and unfortunately for him, a taxi driver decided to make a turn right when he approached, causing them to crash right into it. Who would you blame for this? <laughs> If having close calls was a competition, the owner of this car would be in first place as a Ford truck driver who seems to be low on wheels comes dragging right in front of him after crashing. A peaceful day of cruising down this highway is turned around when a driver who was trying to merge onto the highway lost control of his car in a very weird way and crashed into this Civic and a truck. <gasps> A drunk driver seems to be all over the road as he narrowly avoids a lot of traffic coming the opposite way. This man calls it when the driver finally decides to stop by rear-ending a parked van. Right there. Boom. Not everyone is as skilled as a race car driver, and this guy especially is not well equipped to thread the needle between these two trucks. Thankfully, nobody got hurt except for the car. In a fit of rage, this driver keeps ramming into another parked car, and when the cops arrive, he makes sure to get a few more hits in before getting arrested because nothing can redeem him now. This driver is trying to slide his car in an empty parking lot, but ends up hitting the pole so hard that he forgets that he can still open the car's door instead of slithering out of the window. seems to be lost when it comes to driving as she not only gets her car stuck on the curb, but has been driving around without a full set of wheels. Brave of the camera woman to walk in front of the car. Don't drive. You have no tire. Here is why you should get to higher ground whenever a Mustang leaves a car mate. The driver just sits there knowing that he messed up big time. Some things can't be avoided, such as sitting at the red light waiting for it to go green and being rear-ended by another driver who was too busy figuring out how to break their car. Shit. A suspect speeds through an intersection and rams into another cop car before going into the parking lot and crashing once more. We're getting real-life GTA 6 before the actual GTA 6. 
even on the tracks, sometimes not everything goes according to plan, and this drifter needs to tweak out a lot of errors after his embarrassing crash. This buggy driver and his beautiful ride became prey for the evil eye as a stupid driver decided to make a turn from the wrong lane without any blinkers or any warning. This station wagon driver made the mistake of trying to whip their heavy and big car around a turn on the wet roads, and almost paid the price for their rash decision making, but luck was on their side today. This dad just purchased a brand new C8 Corvette and decided to show everyone what the thing was capable of. The car was capable of many things, but the driver, not so much, and he crashed the fresh car. This man just got new front wheels on his car, as it seems, and wanted to show his friends a few tricks. Those tricks ended up costing him very dearly as he managed to curb the car very hard. This driver was driving down this road and was about to cross the green light when suddenly someone ran the red light. The driver had just gotten their license and even had the audacity to ask our camera guy if they didn't see the light was red. Oh my god! We all love Honda S2000s, don't we? Then I can confidently say that we hate these things crashing too, and this driver decided to do a pull on wet roads, only to end up destroying the car. At this point, why even bother installing these signals anymore if dumb drivers like this one are only going to end up running through them as if they own the roads? This driver had a very close call with death as a stupid driver came flying on the wrong side of the road at full speed and with their lights to the maximum as well. The white car pulled out of the parking lot and then proceeded to keep turning without any warning and didn't even bother to use her mirrors. Later, you can see her trying to blame everything on the other driver. I had my blinker on. I didn't see you. A dumb driver decided to change ramps at the very last second, which caused the truck driver to turn right in order to avoid a crash and then ended up getting rear-ended by another poor driver. Yes. Before sitting in your car, it is vital to check the surroundings because you never know what is around your car, even if it's at your own home. No worries, he can slap it back on if he wants. Never mess with truck drivers and always make sure to stay disciplined in your lane. This driver tried forcing themselves in, but the trucker was not going to let this disrespect slide. Just when you think everything is going right, a speeding driver comes along and drives on two wheels just so they can get past your car. Don't you just hate that? This C-Class driver spins the car out and almost ends up hitting the railing on the road. Now, you might think that must have been a lesson for him, but as he starts moving again, he begins doing the same exact thing again. With visibility already suffering because of the rain, this driver rams into a stupid driver who pulls out onto the lane and just stops their car there. What was the driver even thinking? Oh my f God! Here is why speeding on a bike is a very dangerous thing. Even the Tesla, which is supposed to predict these things, wasn't able to see the bikes coming. You know you're a bad driver when you manage to crash your car in an empty parking lot. The only things to look out for were these poles, and that's exactly what the driver ended up hitting anyway. Now, this is a confusing bit. Comment down below who you think is in the wrong, the Mercedes driver or the BMW driver. In my opinion, I think it's the latter. With his fender protectors already hanging, this driver decided to do a burnout in his car, and that resulted in burst tires that he probably can't pay for right now. What would you do if you saw the road disappear under the water? If you were this person, then you would most definitely want to see how deep your car can go before destroying the engine. Keep your eyes on the blue SUV on the right because this stupid driver makes a sudden change of plans oh, oh. and rammed into another oh. SUV trying to take the exit. Oh. This trucker got himself into a lot of trouble when he decided to go under a bridge that was clearly too short for his cargo oh and ended up destroying it. Um. Right in front of the cops, a driver suddenly shifted all the way from the right lane to the left, which got them rear-ended by a driver who wasn't expecting to come across such stupidity that day. Here was another driver who suddenly decided to make a turn when nobody would expect them to. They don't even bother using blinkers and cause this poor guy to go flying into the woods. 
This poor driver almost became flat as a pancake when a blind trucker didn't give them way even after several warnings. It almost looked like it was done on purpose. If there are multiple lanes, make sure to look into all of them before pulling out onto the road, or you might end up regretting everything like this driver. I think they should make these lights 10 times bigger because these drivers are not going to pay any attention to them and will keep running these signals like this guy over here. If you're feeling sleepy, then it would be best not to drive that day because here is the POV of someone who fell asleep behind the wheel and luckily for him, he didn't get into a serious situation this time. Speeding down this road at very high speeds, this BMW driver forgot how to control his car. And as soon as he made a quick turn, the car spun out, thankfully missing everyone else on the road. This driver is also speeding down the highway and seems to be doing it in a truck. The car zooms about, changing lanes again and again when finally the inevitable happens and the vehicle spins out. This guy was just showing his friend the new fancy perfume bottle that he'd just bought and little did he know, the perfume wasn't the only thing he was going to have to pay for today as a driver backed right into his car. Here we have another driver that decided to merge onto the lane after using the shoulder to cut everyone off, but this driver's not going to give them any space on their watch. Snowy roads and bad drivers make the best and worst combination ever. This BMW driver slides right into a structure in one of the slowest crashes ever and still floors the gas pedal. This Lexus driver almost spun his car out while making a turn, but that didn't stop him from finishing the job later on as he spun out of control again and drove into oncoming traffic. This driver was almost about to make the green light when a red light runner came rushing in. When the two collided, she acted as if she was in the right. With already a battle scar on the poor car's hood, this driver still wanted to redeem himself with some donuts. And unluckily for him, his skills were still pretty bad. While leaving his car made the BMW driver lost a little control of their car, but overreacted so much that they ended up making things worse rather than better and crashed into the side of the road. These guys were on a mission to see how fast they could go on this dark road with very little visibility at this speed. When they saw the car standing in front of them, it was too late and nothing they could do would stop their car on top. <laughs> After almost spinning out of control because of the fast corners, this driver manages to save the car from hitting the toll booth, but we all know the regret and silence on the way back home after this. This driver almost ran into a pedestrian because of the golf driver who failed to see them while changing lanes. The sigh of relief he must have had after stopping on time. Somebody with a loose nut parked their car in front of another and blocked them in, but this driver wasn't having it and began to make their way out forcefully. Do you think that was deserved? At first, everything seems alright, but that Jeep driver has the attention span of a goldfish and doesn't pay attention to the car before rear-ending it. Imagine seeing this while trying to merge onto the highway. Two cars crashing right in front of you as you enter the place. If it were me, I would just immediately get off. This peaceful ride takes a turn for the worse when a driver ends up cutting the truck driver off for no reason, causing the big vehicle to lose control and almost crash. Just when this guy thought he had made it past the green light as soon as it turned yellow, a red light runner came rushing in and crashed into him. Or Here's another person who just wanted to fly by through this signal, but a person who probably can't see the color red ended up crashing right into them. There seems to be no end to these red light runners. The white car at the front innocently stops and gets moving once again once the signal turns green. That is when a Wrangler came rushing in immediately and almost T-boned the poor car. The 
right lane has some work going on, and the driver of this car instantly realizes it. He slows down to give the white car space to turn, but this gesture went to waste when the driver still managed to crash into the work truck. A speeding truck lost control and hit its brakes when the idiot driver didn't pay attention on the road, rear-ending this innocent driver. It could have been worse, but a guardian angel was looking after this guy, it seems. This driver is just zooming past intersections in this city block area, and from a mile away you can see a white Corolla with its blinkers on making a turn. Who would you blame for this accident? In a very weird twist of events, this driver reported an idiot behind the wheel coming in hard and still accelerating as the massive truck rear-ends this poor guy. Reminds you of jump scares from video games, doesn't it? A Jeep driver runs a stop sign and causes the other car to fly into the electricity pole, after which they just run off. Now that's what you call a miss and run. Road rage is never a nice thing, and these two truckers are going at each other on the highway. Finally, the match comes to a close when the white truck makes the other one crash all over the road. With a car lifted as high as this one, there's a pretty good chance of it flipping over like this. Doesn't look like much damage, though. In a weird twist, this yellow Mustang driver runs a red light, goes too wide and comes back round for revenge, and crashes into the same car. 